good? This your boy TRNT, and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a brand new album reaction by your boy T Grizzly, aka my twin. Yeah, they used to call me T, T Grizzly back in the day, but anywho, um, I'm about to check out this whole album. And unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I do not skip the song, I do not pause the song, I listen to the whole song, and at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from zero to ten, ten being the best. So if it's a trash song, that's zero to five. If it's a mid-average okay, that's six. If it's a good song, that's seven and above, just depending on how good y'all think it is. So without further ado, this is T Grizzly, Coney Island. You dig? Make sure y'all subscribe and make sure y'all stay to the end. Please, you dig? Let's go. Going to go on a bunch and making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. <laughs> City of Gods featuring Chris Brown. <laughs> about it man that's chris brown city of god that's the third song i heard on the album to me that's probably the best song um but let's keep it all the way funky it's too short it's too short of a song it's only two minutes and 15 seconds and i know why they make the short song so it could be get replay value i don't know if they pushing this record but i think this the late the label should have pushed this one out as a single um, he probably got other singles. Matter of fact, I'm about to react to one of his singles next. But um, I like the whole Coney Island ideal, you know what I'm saying? Because I know people from Detroit. Um, Detroit been on the map a lot lately. Uh, shout out to uh, 50 Cent BMF crew. They've been putting Detroit in. Every, in every Detroit scene from Big Sean to all the older rappers, they'll tell you it ain't official if they don't talk about a Coney Island. And um, it's damn near one on every neighborhood, you know what I'm saying, out there. But, um, yeah, I fuck with the song, but it's not long enough. That's why when it's 0 to 10, this is, I'm going to get this one an 8. Like, it's a good song. It's better than the rest I uh, gave it, but it's not long enough. Like, And then it got me thinking about uh, the fact that it got Chris Brown on there. A lot of Chris Brown records just get shopped around like through the music industry. So I don't know if this was like an organic record, like they was both in the studio same time. Sometimes the way Chris Brown worked, he worked with a whole bunch of producers to where he just dropped hooks and beats and they just sent it out and whoever, you know what I'm saying, get it first and kill it, 
it go on their album. That's what I think this was. So with that being said, I'm going to give it an 8. But tell me what y'all think about this song, what y'all think about the album, what y'all think about Chris Brown, what else y'all want to add to the conversation, and what else music y'all want me to react to. I'm doing reactions every day. You dig? Appreciate y'all for staying with me. We're going to rock out to the next album, I mean the next song, so click the next video. But don't forget the Leo grade. Don't forget to subscribe. And if not, peace.